Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs continues surveillance of disease trends and provides the public with the following updates. On May 5, 2023, the World Health Organization declared that COVID-19 was no longer a public health emergency of international concern. However, it still remains an ongoing public health issue as St. Lucia continues to record confirmed cases of COVID-19 despite a generally low testing rate. Currently, the dominant variant of COVID-19 in St. Lucia is an Omicron subvariant called XBB.1.5. Over the last three weeks, we note increased numbers of persons with respiratory illness presenting at both public and private health facilities. The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs advises the general public to adhere to the following preventative measures for respiratory illness. Wash hands frequently or use hand sanitizers. Avoid close contact with persons who are sick. Do not report to work or attend social activities if you are feeling sick. Visit your healthcare provider for the management of your signs and symptoms. Consider wearing a mask when in public, especially if you have flu-like symptoms. Following the statement released on July 15, 2023, regarding the surge in the number of gastroenteritis cases, the Ministry of Health continues to record increases in cases. In the weeks post-carnival celebrations, July 23rd to August 5th, a significant increase in cases of gastroenteritis was noted. A 71% increase in cases was recorded between the week July 23 to 29 and July 30th to August 5th. The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs continues to advise on the following measures to reduce the incidence of gastroenteritis. Practice good hand hygiene. Wash hands frequently and thoroughly with soap and water, especially after vomiting, using the toilet and before handling food. Do not eat undercooked foods. Disinfect contaminated surfaces and objects frequently to eliminate the virus or bacteria. If you are sick, avoid going to work until 24 hours after your symptoms have passed. Do not prepare meals if you are sick. Boil your drinking water. Food handlers are encouraged to ensure that the food is prepared in a safe and suitable manner for public consumption and that public health certificates are current and valid. If you have symptoms of gastroenteritis, please seek medical care at your nearest wellness center. If your symptoms do not improve or if you have signs of dehydration. Signs of dehydration include a dry mouth, lips and tongue, dark yellow, strong smelling urine, feeling thirsty, feeling tired, dizzy, or lightheaded. You may be asked to produce a stool sample. The Ministry of Health, Wellness, and Elderly Affairs remains vigilant and will continue to provide updates to the public.